Hello, it's Nicole Surgent here. Here we are at the Great Pyrenees Rescue. We have a doggy friend getting bathed over here. As you can see, moving forward, we are heading towards some puppy pens and enclosures. You have to walk all the way back past the gate to get to the good stuff which I think some people did and do last time we saw a video from this group. So looking forward to showing you guys all of these spacious accommodations for these guys back here. Okie dokie. So here we have places that animals are kept. They have some nice big room to roam. This guy right here is really friendly. He's got himself a little pool. Hi, buddy. How are we doing? These animals are very friendly, just so we know. If you want to understand their temperament, I'm going to stick my little hand out here. Hello, friend. Hello, friend. Oh, and I just got a kissy. Okay. So. As you can see, we have a happy dog that's digging holes, has a pile of sticks. It's got a little pool back here. Happy as can be, wagging his tail. All right, let's keep going. Let's visit some more of our furry friends. We have different enclosure sizes too. This one is cleared out right now for bathing time. If we want to go take a look at how much space is back here, We've got lots of food dishes. We've got a crate that we can sleep in if we want to. We have an enclosure. And this is pretty big. This is probably the size of my kitchen back home. So, we've got lots of room to roam. This buddy right here is still excited to see us. But he's also got lots of room in the same size pen. So, moving back here where we have some more furry friends. We have another gated enclosure for the dog's protection. So we can make sure that all of our furry friends stay safe. And we have some really massive pins back here. We've got two friends in this one. These pins aren't as open, but we do have one pin where a friend is getting bathed right now. So we can walk in there and get to see how large these are. When we walk in here, we can see we've got some plants, we've got some dirt, we've got some grass, we've got a little building back here that our furry friends can stay in if they want to. It's like a shed. Have their own trees. We have one friend that's next to us that's a little excited, so we'll go visit with them. But this is a really large enclosure. It's hard to see for scale because we don't have a pup in here, but rest assured these animals are having more than enough space to deal with. Now if we can go over here to one of our smaller enclosures, which is still pretty big by rescue standards, you can come see your friend. Hello, buddy. Look at that tail wag. What a happy good boy automatically sits down. He's got his own little places to sleep in there. He's got his food container. He's got a little patch of grass in the corner. And this is a happy puppy, aren't we? Yes, we are. Let's see. I don't know. I haven't seen any kind of aggression out of these animals here. Okay. So even with the smaller enclosures, these dogs have plenty of room to roam and frolic. So let's keep moving on down the line here. We've got a buddy here. He's in a similar enclosure to the one we just saw where there's lots of fence, lots of space, mud to play in. He's got some grass. Look at that look in his lips. He thinks I have food, but he just ate. And I just saw him get fed a little while ago. So we're doing good here. Oh, and we got a double pin with two friends. And if you see, it is twice the size of the other one that's right next to it. These are two very happy pups. Hello. Hello. Are you guys good? You well fed? You look well fed and happy. Yes, 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 yes. 
Good dogs. So, and to round out the tour de pups, we have an enclosure back here that is one of the larger ones that we can walk into. And I took a photo of this one yesterday. It is larger than my apartment downtown, without a doubt. It can fit human living conditions in here very easily. We have piles of sticks for dogs to play with. We have little makeshift shelters back here. So if there's weather, we can be covered up. This probably could house minimum of four or five dogs if we wanted to. There's no one in here, but usually there's one dog per enclosure, which we can see over here with another large enclosure and one dog right here. Hello. Hello. Look at that tail wag. These are some happy dogs with lots of room. All right. Well, just even going on a walkthrough, we can see these are some really happy dogs with lots of space. And I'm glad you're getting to see firsthand for yourself the conditions of this place because there is nothing here to indicate they're anything but great situations for these guys. Let's say bye bye to our animals. Say bye to our furry friends. Oh, thank you for the kiss. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you for our co stars, the pups today. We'll be sharing some more with you soon.